Hello everyone, this is Josef Neut here and welcome back to the CFD summer series where we talk about open form and CFD related topics. And today I'm coming to you with openform.com. I hope you know this homepage and I'm not going to show you openform.com, but I would like to draw your attention to a certain tutorial here. So but let's start the journey by clicking here on the open form governance link and if you're interested in the new open form governance system just go through it uh, what i want to talk about here is the technical committees because i had the privilege to be nominated and also ratified as the chair for technical committee of documentation and tutorials and within this position uh, Myself and the members of this committee have the task to create documentation for OpenFOAM and also new tutorials. And I started this, and I hope you know this, the wiki.openform.com, because this has been around now for years, just integrated into, as a technical committee. And uh, to show you the new tutorial and the new formatting of, tut of official uh, tutorials of OpenFOAM, I want to show you this by clicking here on Collection by Contributors, looking for My Tutorials, and you see here Rotating Fan in Room. This is the new tutorial that I created. And if I click here on Rotating Fan in Room, you are being brought to this page. This is now the official documentation of the development version of OpenFOAM. So you will not find this tutorial yet in 1906, but if you are watching this video after 1912 is being released, so most probably in 2020 or later on, then you will already have this tutorial available in your open form release out of the box. So in 1912 or 2006, 2012 and so on, you just have to go into your open form installation and go for the tutorials and incompressible pimple form arrays and rotating fan in room. If you're watching this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can get this without download, without having the development version. Okay, so, but uh, the topic of the, today's discussion is this um, um, uh, new tutorial, what you think about it. Uh, the formatting and um, and the idea behind it. So um, here you find the geomet description of the geometry. It's a rotating fan in a room with a desk and a window and a door. And I uh, explain you how you can ex uh, create the mesh, which uh, commands to execute, which settings to look for, and then how you can create a mesh, how the rotation works, and also the boundary conditions that you have to create or and use for this um, tutorial also how you can control the rotation additional dictionaries and then how you run your simulation on four cores and then a couple of exemplary results here so I bring you this video to talk about this. What do you think about this kind of tutorials? This is now an official tutorial that you will find in 1912. And what I personally love is that you can you have these cross references, for example, to Snappy Hex Mesh, or if you're interested in boundary conditions, in no slip boundary conditions, what's happening there, or the, for example, the pressure inlet outlet velocity. There you have a short description of that. Yeah. So what do you think? Let me know your um, ideas below in the comment section below. And now let me come back to this link here. If you click, click this link, this is the current development version in August. So if you don't have 1912 yet, because you're watching this video before the release of 1912 in I don't know, September or October 2019, then you can get this tutorial by going here to download and downloading the zip file. This will download not only the tutorial, but the entire development version. I did that. It's not a big zip file. It's 65 uh, megabytes big. And if you then um, extract the zip file, then you can go to tutorials and then incompressible pimple foam RIS and here rotating fan in room and then you can run the all run script or just run the simulation step by step 
and I plan to create a guided um, video tutorial on this tutorial in September. So look out for that. I will upload it sometimes in September or maybe beginning of October. Let's see, depending also on the community Christmas competition. Okay, so this is the video that I want and this is what I wanted to show you, this new formatting of uh, tutorials. Uh, what do you think about that? And um, let me know your comments below. And if you have suggestions, you can uh, create an issue with improvement by clicking on this. Uh, um, uh, on this uh, button and then you can give us your comments. I think you have to be registered to development.openform.com but then just register to this page and then you can give us your comments. But if you have just small ideas just let me know in the comment section below this video. So I hope that you like this uh, new tutorial and the idea and the, the structure behind it. I would like to thank you for watching and listening and I hope to see you next time.